There are no vacancies in that new affordable housing units tonight. Some people now calling it home. They've been waiting for more than a decade for this opportunity. Eyewitness News reporter Lena Folk was at the grand opening ceremony. Lena? Well, Rochelle, the College Heights Cottages is the name of this new community in East Bakersfield. And the residents are very excited. This is under the Golden Empire Affordable Housing Incorporated. And according to their executive director, all of the units are full. I don't know where I would be if it wasn't for this program, but I am very grateful just to be moving on a site that is practically brand new and to be furnished. I mean, what more can a homeless person ask for? Helen Patricio was on the low-income public housing waiting list for 12 years. But Patricio says to never give up because today she has her own fully furnished apartment in a gated community. Located in East Bakersfield, the College Heights cottages had their grand opening. But Executive Director Stephen Pels says he hopes these affordable units will become the norm instead of having these occasional ceremonies. I think it's a problem when we have to have a grand opening and celebrate the fact that we're building affordable housing. It should be a something that just happens within our community, within our state, within our nation. It's it's a blessing, honestly. Like we, We're very thankful to all the agencies that came together to make this possible. Um, but I also know it, it took longer than it should have. Golden Empire first got site control in 2019. Construction took 24 months, something that Pell said was longer than expected. Other delays involved bringing power to the homes. But despite the challenges, the ceremony was filled with joy. I'm so happy to be here around uh, fam people that I know, you know, that's real kind, you know. Resident Glenda Warren moved in a few weeks ago. She gave us a tour of her house, which features a full kitchen, bedroom, and bathroom. After unexpectedly losing her brother, Warren said this apartment is a blessing from God. I went through a lot, you know, losing my brother. But, um... I was just grateful God sent me down here. It helps a lot, because I ain't got to pay no $1,000 for no rent no more. <laughs> Hallelujah, glory to the most high. The housing authority currently has four projects under construction and will break ground on new projects later this year. Never give up on your dreams. Keep the faith and believe in yourself and that you can accomplish anything as long as you put your mind to it. Well, the opening ceremony of College Heights also featured remarks from Kern Behavioral Health and Recovery Services, as this affordable housing also plans to have mental health resources for residents as well. Live in studio, Lena Folk, Eyewitness News.